Let's begin by taking a look at some of the improvements to the Start Page and Help, often called the Enterprise Architect User Guide. The Start Page has been improved with the ability to quickly open and remove items from the recent model list. You can now right click on a list item to quickly remove the model from the list. Press Ctrl plus click on a model or use the context menu to open in a new instance of Enterprise Architect. I find this particularly helpful because it allows me to easily switch between multiple instances of Enterprise Architect without closing the active model. It is also helpful when copying and pasting packages or making comparisons between models. The help will now open online by default, ensuring that you always have access to the latest and most up-to-date Enterprise Architect user guide. The Enterprise Architect user guide has been redesigned to make it easier to search and navigate. By default, it will be accessed via the internet. Breadcrumbs help to simplify navigation, placing each topic in context. It also makes it easier to navigate within a given subject area such as requirements management. You can also search for new topics such as the heat map capability that was introduced in Enterprise Architect 12.1. You can download a copy of the user guide if you require an offline version. It is available from both the website and via the help menu system in Enterprise Architect. To install help locally from Enterprise Architect 12.1, select Help followed by Online Resources and install help locally. Enterprise Architect now offers Google Translate features for online help. Google Translate features have been added to make it easier for customers who access help when using the French, Spanish, Japanese, German or Chinese version of Enterprise Architect. Spark Systems has a large international audience of customers who use Enterprise Architect on a daily basis. This feature makes it much easier for them to find answers in their native language. The examples on screen demonstrate how it can be used for German and Chinese, but many other languages are readily available. For more information about Enterprise Architect 12.1, please visit www.sparksystems.com.